I usually see patients with functional gut disorders, things like IBS, functional dyspepsia, reflux, but I'm starting to see patients that are interested in their gut health. So I, I'd like to press people to think of gut health as being for everybody. So we can work on our gut health in uh, disease like IBD, like IBS, but also in wellness and maintaining that gut health. So I really like to take a very interdisciplinary approach, looking at not only nutrition factors, but also lifestyle factors. So making sure people include a variety of different foods focused on prebiotic fiber, uh, probiotics, including fermented foods. I like to challenge people to eat something living every day if they can. So, so many people follow restrictive diets now and it's really a challenge because we're starting to see those restrictive diets have negative implications on the microbiome. It's something that I work with on my patients in regards to changing their perceptions and reducing restriction. For IBS, looking at how they typically eat, potentially looping in medical nutrition therapy, something like the low FODMAP diet, also working on that brain-gut connection. Uh, as well, medication management when required. I like to say food first, medication second.